Hey guys, we're going to be looking at um, level 1 algebra paper from 2011, day 3, question 3C2. The question is, it was a lead up question, so there was like three other questions that led up to this question. Um, so, well, I kind of do all three parts in this one question, but anyway, let's get started, yeah? So, this was the question, uh, solve x squared minus 4x minus 5 divided by x squared plus 6x plus 5 equals 2. So in the previous question, you were given the fraction without the equals 2 part, and you needed to simplify it. But I'll, like I said, I'll do the whole thing again. So when you get the situation, the first thing you want to do is you want to factorize. So if I factorize the numerator, which is the green box right there, and the purple box is the denominator. So the green box, when I factorize that, I'm going to get x minus 5 multiplied by x plus 1. And that's divided by the denominator, which is the purple box. If I factorize that, I get x plus 5 multiplied by x plus 1. And all this equals 2. So what you can see is you have a couple of common factors. So if you notice, you would see that x plus 1 is in the numerator and the denominator as well. Therefore, we can get rid of them. So what you have now is x minus 5 over x plus 5 equals 2. So rearranging it, I'm going to get x minus 5 equals 2 multiplied by x plus 5. So just doing this on the other side. So expanding the right hand side, I'm going to get x minus 5 equals 2x plus 10. Rearranging. I'm going to get x equals 2x plus 10 minus 5 when it switches over to the right hand side is plus 5. So x is equal to 2x plus 15. Now rearranging x is all to one side. So bringing 2x to this side will become minus 2x. So x minus 2x is equal to 15. Now x minus 2x is negative x, which is 15. Therefore, x is equal to negative 15. Alright guys, and that is how you do this question. Thank you for watching.